On our construction sites, one important thing we have to do is stabilize all of the soil, whether it's on a flat surface or a steep hill. Examples are, are all over the place. This here we have sod. That's a great alternative to go straight to a permanent sort of erosion control, permanent stabilization. This house is going to have sod here eventually. It's usually cheapest to just go straight to sod rather than come in with an alternative uh, temporary product that then has to be replaced later. Another alternative that we have for flat surfaces is a product like a PAM-12, which is a, uh, it's a chemical. It's a chemical, and here the chemical is actually on these paper granules. So to apply this to the, the surface, it really just gets spread out. And then water, rain, or we could wash water over this, they'll wash that chemical into the soil and it causes the soil to crust up, giving an erosion-proof layer which stabilizes the bare soil as well. Just like how this is crusting up the soil, this PAM-12, really anything that will get between the raindrop and the soil surface will provide an erosion control. Weedy vegetation can get between a raindrop and the soil surface. You could use dead grass as well. And we see a lot of mulches, wood mulch, agricultural cuttings like hay or straw. Those are all sorts of things that are applied to a site to stabilize a flatter ground surface. There's a lot of variety of erosion control blankets and really the difference is how long it's going to remain before it decays and uh, breaks down. You have longer term blankets which have coconut fibers, a very sturdy fiber which will last several construction seasons. And then as you get into lighter duty blankets, you get into other straw, wood fiber, or even a, a, almost a paper fiber, uh, which break down really quickly. So uh, there's a large spectrum of different products with different nettings, different types of nettings, whether it's plastic or a jute, nettings on both sides, just a whole variety depending on how strong and how long you need that product to last on your construction site. When you have a steep soil slope, a uh, product like mulch often isn't good enough to hold that slope in place. You need something stronger. One alternative, especially on a temporary steep slope like on a stockpile, is a tarp. The rain will travel along the tarp and not move or erode the soil beneath it. So that is a, a great way to handle a uh, temporary cover on a steep slope. Another alternative for a permanent establishment of vegetation would be an erosion control blanket. Although your site may be small, the cumulative impacts of pollutants from improperly managed construction sites contributes to the degradation of our lakes and streams. Do your part to keep the pollution on your site and out of our waters.